Um, so this is our this is our sales room, mm -hmm. and we purposely designed our sales room to be not super big mm -hmm. and a little bit cozier. And we mm -hmm. wanted to have kind of colors that are similar to what a lot of people have in their homes, so it's fairly neutral. Mm -hmm. um, a couple important things here: when we designed this, we actually specifically designed it to have the um, screen go on this side so that we had a variety of sizes of walls. We have one large wall, mm -hmm. one kind of medium-sized wall, mm -hmm. a slightly smaller wall, and then a, you know, a pretty small wall. Okay, exactly. Sure. So the reason is, is that when people are not really sure where they're gonna put their images, uh -huh. they can then say, oh, you know, do you have a wall that's kind of like one of these? Right. And they can generally relate to this. Um, another thing we did that's really important is under our screen we put this piece of furniture which is about the same size as a piece of, as a, a standard fireplace. Mm -hmm. So when we're projecting over our this piece of furniture, they can have an idea for of scale. Mm -hmm. um, we have different you know wall groupings and things. And on this wall, there's actually a couple that are missing, but on this wall we've got a mixture of canvas and frames mm -hmm. in a variety of sizes because we find that people either like something eclectic like this uh -huh. or they like something very clean lines right so and if people already have things that are framed we want to be able to show them that they can put up frames and canvases and it's all going to look great together. Look so if you like tips like this please feel free to share this with your friends comment below i love hearing comments from you and then also, I have a new book. It's at joynewbook.com. It's only $5.60, and it's great um, quick ideas that you can implement right away to help you get more high-ticket clients in the door. And it's at joynewbook.com.